So you're still glad you made us miss out on that breakfast in bed? <laughs> yeah. Well, I'll just go and check in on my mum and then get a bottle of champagne if you want. Champagne? Hmm. Wow. That hotel has turned your head. <laughs> Carry on the honeymoon back at ours. Uh, bus starts that way, mate. I'll tell Joe you're bunking again. What? Why have they charged her now? I mean, the acid attack was ages ago and, and the police weren't looking at her. We haven't even been gone long. I can't believe how much we missed. Yeah, and that no one told us. Well, we didn't want to burst your bubble, did we? I want to see photos of everything. Come on. Oh, and you better have bought me back all them Diddy shampoos. <laughs> yeah, but it doesn't feel like the right time, though, with Debbie being locked up. Yeah, n no, we can probably save it until we got some of the stuff out of the way. Well, it was our wedding gift, Paddy. I kind of want to see how they spent it. Yeah, and I want to know how you are doing. We better know you're back. Cos, like I said, we can focus on priorities. Like us. And Gracie. The funeral. Funeral? How can we have a funeral with everything that's going on? Everyone's missing. Well, it depends who you want to be there, doesn't it? We're not even discussing. Well, the whole family, obviously. Kind of stupid questions, that. I found her looking for Adam on some website. Apparently, Joe leaving suddenly has really affected her. Fingers crossed, I persuaded her to drop it. Vic, will you stop blanking me and listen? If Adam comes back, he goes straight to jail. Do you get that? Him and Moira could both go down. I don't want him to come back. I'll fly out to be with him. How? He's not going to pop up on some forum. We don't even know what country he's in. 